Hi, I'm Macy Neely. And I am Jessie Natikara, and we are here with It Girl doing Search Bar. <laughs> Woo! Are you allowed to drink alcohol as a Mormon? Definitely not. <laughs> but I, I, I like to break the rules. <laughs> She's naughty. Yeah. <laughs> Would you rather have a sip of alcohol or kill a puppy? Okay, I've seen these on TikTok where on Mormon FBYU. kids are like, kill a puppy. I will like, take a sip of alcohol, thank you. Okay, here you go. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, well, not right now. <laughs> okay, what is soaking and have you ever done it? I have not done it because I'm a bad Mormon. I just go straight to sex. But soaking is where they insert the penis into the vagina and then someone jumps on the bed for the movement. So technically you're still a virgin because you're not thrusting yourself. Mm, mm -hmm. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. I mean, like, yeah. Like they're soaking, but then like sometimes they have someone shake the bed, but it's not always to get, like it's not always shaking the bed. Okay, so sometimes they just sit so, still. And just sit exactly. still. I don't know. It's weird. So no ejaculation, I'm assuming. I guess. I guess so not. Bad. Have you ever drank alcohol or coffee? Yes. I have. Which one? so bad. Both. Oh. Ooh, I had more mint. This one's so funny. Would you rather have $5 million or talk to Joseph Smith for five minutes? <laughs> I, I know that one. That's an easy one for Five you. million. Give me the money. <laughs> I'd probably take the money too. So. Really? Yeah. Okay. I'll meet him in the afterlife. Yeah, it's there fine. you go. <laughs> this is going to be a hard one. I have a funny Oh, shit. Take a shot. I really? I do it. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop being Switzerland and rank the moms in mom talk. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, okay. Oh. Was Pat. it that? Okay, it's fine. That might need to be my chaser. <laughs> okay, I've got real vodka. Well, that was great. I feel like I'm gonna be next. Um, I'm gonna have to take Ooh, a shot. That woke me up, baby. <laughs> She's here. I'm like, I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, do you think Jen should divorce Zach? I'm gonna have to take a shot for this one. <laughs> hey, I'm surprised you didn't answer that. Uh, <clears throat> wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good. Drink a little I'm like, bit I need mine. a little something to chase that. <laughs> I wanna smell it. Mine's worse than yours for sure. Ooh. <laughs> Straight gasoline. That, like, <laughs> made me think of my past. There's my answer. Oh, okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. That's hit my tummy a little bit. <laughs> okay. Um, do you think Taylor and Dakota will make it? Oh, God. I'm going to say yes. Mm. I just feel like they're, like, inseparable. Like, the amount of times they broke up and got together. They're, I don't, like, like, toxically I don't love. think they can be, like, away from each other. Can you imagine them trying to co-parent? No. <laughs> it would be a nightmare. Absolutely not. <laughs> no. Okay, how Mormon are you on a scale from one to 10? I'm gonna say zero, for yeah. sure. <laughs> I'm an Exmo. I don't even know what I would be. Maybe like a, what did I say on the show? Maybe like a seven or eight? Yeah, I think so. That sounds about accurate. Sounds about right. Yeah. Did Whitney text you before or after your baby mama event? And how did it feel having her expose your texts online? Oh. She texted me like, four days before the event, and then like, I wanna say like three or four days after. So she didn't text me the night of my event. And, and it, just to say congrats, like nothing. Yeah. Wow. Exactly. Um, and how did it feel having her expose your text online? It felt very shitty. I was very pissed. Even though the text didn't really say like anything like incriminating, it was still weird to have someone who claims to be your best friend expose your text online. And I did not like that one bit. Not not a good friend right there. Okay, how much did your labiaplasty, labiaplasty surgery cost? Um, I think it was like six grand. Honestly worth every penny. I love it. Yeah. Self-care queen. Um, are you in communication with Whitney today? No, not not like currently right this second, but I have been. Yeah, not maybe like in the this future, second. we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Which girl in the group would you go lesbian for? <laughs> oh my God. I feel like it's creepy to answer because everyone says we look the same. So I'm like, really oh, am I attracted song. to myself, you know? Yeah, I mean, I would Honestly, be. I'm gonna say Macy because she got a fat ass. <laughs> Ooh, uh, I'm so fly. I know, right? <laughs> Um, do you think Mom Talk will make it? Yes, Mom Talks of course. Fine. I think it'll make it. Yeah. I mean, we're still going pretty strong. Like, it's not all the original girls, but. I think it's gonna be fine. <laughs> we'll be fine. Um, who got a better edit than they deserved on the show? Oh, that's an interesting one. I would say to me. Oh, really? Yeah. She was, she went hard at people for sure. I would say to me or Jen. I was gonna say Jen. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I do because I feel like Demi did like says things that are very out of pocket. She could have been the villain that people of could that. take the wrong way. Yeah, like I think she could have been a villain. No, Demi, her strong point is that she says those things, but then she has like humor. Yeah. So like wee, like the little things mixed in where it's like funny. Yeah. And so that I think saves her. <laughs> but yeah, yes. Jen, I think got a really um, maybe not even a better edit than they deserve, but I think she definitely was painted as like a really good devout Mormon, and like more uptight than she is. Yeah. You know, in a sense. Well, because there's certain things where she's like, I'm a 9 out of 10 the Mormon scale. And I was like, I've never heard you say that in my life. Yeah, exactly. Like, I thought she, like, she was joking, I think. Oh, Demi? But then it came off across yeah. like I was judgmental. Like, if you're a 9 out of 10, then I'm a 12. True. And I'm like, it was a joke. Yes, it was okay. a joke. Was that a makes joke. sense. So Demi or Jen, probably. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you could sleep with one of your friend's husbands, who would it be and why? So we're doing this for sure. Because oh. I really don't think, I personally, I don't, none of them are my types. So <laughs> I, just not, you're not like Layla being like Brett no, immediately? <laughs> no, like I wouldn't even know because I don't, they're not my type. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's spicy. Mm. Tastes like lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who do you think received the worst edit? Um... Definitely Whitney. Yeah. She's the villain for sure. I do think she was very much herself. So I don't think I can blame it all on the edit, but like the toilet paper on the shoe and like little things they did. I'm like, oh, she was done dirty. You did her dirty. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you guys are giving me hard ones. Okay, this, okay, I'll answer this one. Okay. Um, did anyone receive an edit that's inaccurate representation of who they are outside the show? Um, I would say yes. It's hard to say. There's like a mixture of both because I know Dakota's not happy with his edit. Yeah. Because he's like, I'm a golden retriever, but he has both sides to him, right? Like and a then, little black cat mixed in. <laughs> yeah. And then obviously Whitney. Yeah. There are certain scenes where I was like, okay, like this could have been taken a little out of context. So there, I would say yes. Like I would say maybe, I would say Whitney. Are you serious? Just for the one, okay, <laughs> just for one scene I'm thinking of. Oh, that's why. Okay, you'll have to tell me later. <laughs> yeah, I can't tell you on here. Okay, what can viewers look forward to in season two? If we get a season two, let's cross our fingers. I would say there's a lot of drama brewing right now just because of the aftermath of the show and things actually going on in our real lives. So it would be juicy. I think it would be even better than season one. For sure. Um, <laughs> oh no, it's not that bad. What did Jenna say on your phone call? So Ooh. either way, I can't answer this one because this is not a me problem. This is a season two that we cannot expose. So Ooh. Ooh, you had to do three. <laughs> oh, there we go. Wow. Yep. <laughs> I'm proud of us. We did it. I feel like I'm getting harder questions than you are. <laughs> I know you are. Make sure you watch The Secret Lives of Mormon Wives on Hulu and you can find me on Instagram and TikTok at Macy Neely. And you can find me on Instagram and TikTok as well with underscore just Jesse with four eyes. Okay, I have a question. I don't know if I can do it oh. a full shot. Because I know I can't answer this. But I'm telling you right now, I thought I was going to lose it. Like, I could drink it. I'm just thinking my stomach may not <laughs> yeah, handle the rest of the interview. Not to be a pussy, but like, no, after that first one, I'm not kidding. My hands were shaking. Oh my